Targeting system. Engaged. Well done, all. Well done. We have done all we can. I am sure the Council is waiting to speak with you. I was not certain this would work, but it seems the Serpent has blessed us. You have always lacked faith, Dulkef. One could argue that faith got us into this mess in the first place. Enough! It is time for action, not bickering. Agreed. We must secure the Citadel. Send in everyone. Are you mad? We have no idea how stable this is. No idea what is happening inside. You saw yourself. We barely had a plan for the device. We are lucky to have made it this far. Time is a luxury we do not have. Committing a large force is impossible. There have been reports of increased zealot activity, no doubt in response to what we have been doing here. It would be unwise to leave Dazra even more vulnerable than it already is. And, to be candid, we have no idea what will happen to anyone entering the Citadel. We must minimize the potential risk. I thought perhaps it was obvious where this leads. It is only fitting that it should be you. Really? I do not doubt our newest member's conviction, but... What else can we do, hmm? He is the only one who can communicate with Anasco. Save as much as you can. Save it all, if possible, but... The Speaker must be your priority. Do whatever it takes to bring Anasco back to us. I do not believe we have come this far only to fail now. You must believe that as well. It will be nothing short of the highest honor. We will not fail. We will speak again soon, I hope.
You're really here. Oh, I feared what I saw. That connection we made was yet another vision. This is real, is it not? See you? Yes, of course. So much has been unclear, but here in the Citadel, I am more focused. I knew the Serpent would deliver me from this nightmare, that there must be some way out. Every time I have attempted to leave this place, I find myself lost, wandering, unable to see. There is nothing out there. Tell me, what of Dazra, the people of House Faroon? I have had terrible visions, a dreadful sense of loss. Your loyalty is noted, and indeed appreciated. I cannot help but mourn all that we have lost. All that I have caused. You must believe me. We meant none of this. All of the research, the calculations. We thought we could contain it. I only ever wanted to help. To improve, to elevate House Varun. You do not understand. We cannot simply leave. The chain reaction that started, it is self-sustaining. We tried everything. We had hoped we could complete the experiment, but then the Vortex interlock burned out. You... you have one, don't you? I can feel the power from here. Then the Serpent truly has sent you to us. I wish I could guarantee your safety, but... I am graced by the Serpent, and have retained my faculties. So many of my people were not as fortunate. You will have no choice but to deal with them. The reactor level is below us. Bring the interlock there. We will need it if we wish to see this through. is never necessarily the aim, but if there is something worth thinking. The serpent demands! Oh, my mind indeed that the serpent is a
Quarantine lockdown. I had lost hope. I grew up hearing stories of my grandfather's communion with the Great Serpent. The immense responsibility he was given to create and guide House Veron. By the time I became Speaker and inherited that responsibility, so much had changed. The once proud glory of House Veron was diminished. We had lost our way, and I alone could not discern a path forward. I required the Great Serpent's guidance once more. So, I set out to find him.
If the fate of your entire people was in your hands, would you do any less? Perhaps. But were that true, were he to judge me for it, I could accept that. It would have been worth it, all the same. Perhaps that judgment still awaits me, for thus far I have not seen his glory in person. I learned that my grandfather had attempted something similar. I found reassurance in that idea that he, too, sought additional instruction from the Serpent. And over time, I began to see that the Great Serpent had indeed left a path for me, hidden amongst the experimental failures and setbacks. This vortex, the place between places, and the energy it holds, could be harnessed, refined, directed. No. An unfortunate consequence of simple beings grappling with divine power. A mistake that will not be repeated, I assure you. Utilizing the Vortex energy, we have learned that we can create powerful warriors, capable of teleporting vast distances in an instant. The brave volunteers in this room await the chance to be the first wave of soldiers loyal to the Great Serpent and our cause. House Varun can project force on a scale unimaginable in the history of the human race. Tinan Varun's mandate can be fulfilled. The Serpent's Crusade can begin anew. Despite all that has happened, their life support system has remained stable. Just one more sign from the Great Serpent that we are following his will. And now, the glorious honor falls to you, my faithful servant. Activate the pods. Carry out the Serpent's will, and begin House Varun's triumph! Please, I have waited so long for this. Just activate the pods! You yourself must have encountered the Phantoms in Malin Dam. You know how formidable yet limited their abilities were. The Varun soldiers suspended within these pods are an improvement on all of that prior work. Activate the system, and they will be suffused with vortex energy, making them nearly invulnerable, giving them almost unlimited engagement range. They will be proof that House Varun's ascent to glory has begun. None will be able to deny it. Surely you can see that I am unable, or else I would have done it by now. And I think it fitting that the Great Serpent has led you this far, to now allow you to be the one to restore House Varun to greatness. What other choice do we have? The heathens and heretics loathe our very existence already. Why not be what they expect? By finishing what Jinan Varun started, we fulfill our duty to prepare the way for the Great Serpent. And none will ever again dare mock or belittle us. Peace? You think House Varun has known peace? We suffer. Each and every day, this will restore the balance.
Once we have restored the Citadel, we will have the knowledge and power to send out hundreds, thousands more. Intruders dead. In level. Emergent. Zealots have infiltrated the Citadel. They cannot be allowed to gain control of our work. Waste no time. Ascend the Citadel. Join me at the Pinnacle. We must defend the Vortex Gate. We cannot fail the Great Serpent now.
running out of time. We risk losing everything to the Zealots. So, the gate must cycle one more time, shifting the Citadel into the Vortex and back again. The Zealots inside will be cast into the Void. But, I am sorry to say, so will you. It is the only way. The Serpent's Crusade is too important to risk. The work must carry on. You have served honorably. Your deeds here and your sacrifice will be heralded down through the generations. Child, there is no other way. It cannot be shut down. Not now, when so much is at stake. Not when I am so close. When the Zealots have been purged, we will learn from this experience and we will try again. Eventually, I will be granted an audience with the Great Serpent. My child, you are not being cast aside. I could not have made it this far without you. Your time has just come to its inevitable end. From the moment I commissioned this project, I knew we might suffer losses. I will carry that burden with me, I assure you. No! You will not jeopardize everything now! Yeah, 
slowly, slowly. I you told have you been he through a lot. It. I cannot believe it. The citadel is gone. There is no sign of an Asco. You failed. You brought us no scrap of hope for the future. I do not wish to suggest that I do not care. I would do more than suggest. You are inconsequential compared to the speaker. Why are you standing here instead of in Asco? Then truly, we are lost. Without an Asco, there is no speaker. There is no way forward. Perhaps. Or perhaps we acknowledge a simple truth. We are currently the government. We decide what happens from here. You would dare speak of treason? Heresy! I speak of survival. Please, calm down, both of you. This is not a time to be calm or sit idly by. This is a time for action. We, the three of us, are the High Council. All of House Barun looks to us for guidance. We should provide it. Yes, Jamal is right. We would have to name a new speaker. Malabor, you cannot possibly be considering this madness. We do not have that kind of authority. It is not within our power. But Lovek, it can be. We can decide that right here, right now. We can carve a path forward for House Varun. Or else, we can sit by and watch all that we have built crumble around us. And what assurance do I have that the two of you are not just looking to usurp power for yourselves? Then we let the Vindicator decide. And we have a herald here as a witness. I think it is. Three houses stand before you. Simply choose which should represent House Varun going forward. Then so it shall be. House Varun moves forward from this crisis and continues to serve the Great Serpent. All, All must, must serve. serve. Before you adjourn, is there not one matter more to address? I do not understand. To what do you refer? To the matter of the Serpent's Crusade, of course. The Vindicator knows of what I speak. I don't understand. The Crusade was ages ago. What does that have to do with any of this? Explain the meaning of this at once. Truly, that was the Speaker's wish? Then, our path is clear. Respectfully, I disagree. We are in no position to undertake something like that right now. We need time to rebuild, recover. There is nothing more to discuss. If the Speaker calls for Crusade, then we answer. I can assure you all that he did indeed believe in it. Then House Vethol agrees. The crusade begins. What does House Dulkef say? I... I have no wish to defy the speaker, but he is no longer here. The Varun? No. I should have expected as much. And what does House Kadik say? Both of my colleagues have made valid points. I believe that for the moment, House Kadik abstains. So, one vote for, one against. And what about you? Should we take up the sword and fight for House Varun, or continue to cower here and pity ourselves? Consider what you are about to say very carefully. So be it. And with all of this out of the way, we will take our leave. You have been through a great deal and deserve... The home, of course, is yours. Know that House Varun is eternally grateful for all that you have done. 